Hey everyone, Shin Virtuality here, and we are back with more Pascal's Wager. Uh, we are still deep in the depths of Khatib. Uh, we started off this level last episode, and we got ourselves fairly through part of the ways. Um, but before we start going, we have those three stones that we need to uh, speak to with our sunflowery friend. Um, but before we get there, we're going to hit the altar real quick. Um, I wanted to sort of introduce you guys, since we now have materials for it, uh, for leveling up and uh, reforging trophies. So first let's hit the enhance one, because that'll be easy of the two to understand. And you know what? We're going to boost up our Father's Love trophy. I don't see us uh, unequipping this anytime soon. In fact, we'll probably raise it all the way at some point. But let's do that. And like we had said in the last episode, um, leveling up these trophies take black water debris. And since we have three of them, why not just sort of show you what it does? So if we add plus one, it's going to boost our stats on it. So why not do that? And I'll do it just for the sake of showing you. So yes, we'll confirm enhancing father's love. Done. All right. Uh, and then it'll take two for the next level. And I'm guessing three, four, and five. I don't know if there's a cap. I believe it's five. But for now, let's assume that there's no level cap or... If there is, we won't be hitting it this episode. Uh, next is the Reforge. And what we're going to do, I'm going to take Oath here. Oath is what we got in uh, Elixium, I think it was, with the two, with Jenny and Patrick. Uh, but it's a fairly good um, trophy that uh, I always like to keep the ones that have the gold lettering or the gold writing uh, online because uh, they just add a little bit extra to it. So we're going to add this and then you have this other spot. So since we've been getting some of these mutated claws, we don't really need eight or however many we're going to be getting at the end of this uh, game's run. Uh, we can just take one of them and what it will do, it will add a third category of, um, I guess, uh, bonuses but it's not going to be uh, attack plus eight which is what the mutated claw has uh, it's going to be random uh, I think it's going to be random regardless but all you have to do is just basically craft it and you're rolling the dice so let's see crit rate for plus 4.7 uh, okay so both rate and damage is up and then if we start boosting this, I don't think I'll actually go ahead and do it, but I just wanted to see... Oh no. Alright, so that's <laughs> that's the catch. The third stat will not update with the Blackwater Debris, which is fine. So anything that we now put on our Father's Love, uh, as far as reforging, won't really matter. Okay, so now with that out of the way, let's see if we can't get back to... Uh, or some flower guy without attracting a lot of attention because we hit the altar, everyone's reset. Oh. Hi. Get, get rid of you. There he is. Okay. Let's just keep... Let's just go. Oh, nope. <laughs> Don't run away. I used to be a priest of the church, with flesh and bones, but that was a long time ago. Nowadays, it is quite strange to stay in the form of a human. It is, let me tell you, as a form of a human, I am quite strange. Give it time stones. It seems that you have learned the secrets of the Martians, smart Korea. Please wait a moment. Stay a while and Take listen. This. Take it with you, and you can pass through this poisonous mist unharmed. But what will happen after that? Maybe more pain. <laughs> it 
taking a book and taking a page out of the Joker's book, I would imagine. All right, so we have Martian Puzzle Ball. Uh, go deep into Katib. So I have a feeling just having that in our inventory should. Do we need to equip it? Arg. All right. Uh, let's take a look here then. Oh, yeah, there's a... Uh... Really? We need to wear this? Uh, defense plus 10, able to resist poisonous mist. Uh, okay, so... All right, just for the sake of getting past this, let's, uh, let's equip and go. Mind me, guys, just passing through. Who stuck up the joint? Am I right? Oh, we have an item over here. Let's go grabby grabby. Uh, let's pick it up. Well, at least we got an extra black water debris out of the deal. out. Okay, don't think we can go down there. Well, you guys just, just chill. Uh, and now that we're out, maybe we can just switch this back to what we had. Uh, which I believe was this guy. Just take a look. Yeah. Okay. Moving onwards. Nope. Who's calling your name? Things in order first. We have a page to pick up here. Teresa's parchment. It might be worth reading, but not right now. Howdy. The daydream. It's hard to wake up from. The souls of those wrong can never get justice. No, they can't. Who might you be? The darkness beneath the holy light. The senders you speak of. Are they really the culprit? <sighs> well, shouldn't they be? There exists no right or wrong in this world. It is only the dark abyss found deep within the heart of man that determines good and evil. Yeah, but what is what is good and evil, really? Oh, what, you actually have stuff to ask here, Terence? You don't want to start with an ellipses? Uh, all right, well, let's start with the obvious. Who are you? Who are you? I am Gerald. I'm a stranger from the East. My hometown has already long been in a deep slumber. Unlike the Solas, things here have only recently fallen asleep. Unlike Solas, I don't believe I've been. I want to find a way to end this eternal dream, so I drifted here. Drifted, you say? Though it's none of my business. If you want to live, I suggest you keep away from this sacred tower. Those madmen have no idea what they're doing. Well, apparently the Sacred Tower is my next objective, so I kind of have to go there. Have you met the owner of this cabin? Have you met the owner of this cabin? That fear is which? Presumably you have met those ghosts who fell from grace. They were like us, but because of their greed, the witch talks their dignity with a vengeful flame. You have this echoey sound to your voice. Why is that? Courier, let the past go. 
Stick to the lie that you sincerely you lost. Bow down and gallop into the darkness. Staring at the dazzling light can only make you blind. Listen to me. Do what you can do. Any more than this will only result in agonizing pain as you endure the everlasting circle of sin. Well, at least it's everlasting. How's your wound? How's your wound? I didn't know he had a wound. <laughs> Nothing serious. I just need to rest. You look kind of vampire-y. Are you a vampire? Are you one of them Night Stalker people? Okay, so that's Gerald. Uh, and if we play as him at a later point of the game, I haven't reached it yet. So, uh, a letter about Katib. Katib is dumb. Uh, so just checking around to make sure that nothing is left behind, and let's continue if we on. we want to get closer to the truth, we'll have to take some risks and venture to the secret tower. Of course, it's your call. This has nothing to do with pride or honor. Remember, life always comes first. <laughs> you don't have to go to the secret tower, just that the game needs you to in order to progress the storyline. Uh, okay, well, just making sure that I'm not leaving any items behind, and I'm sure I'm going to have to go back to a couple of these levels and just make sure that whatever I had left is reclaimed. But for now, there's the sacred tower. Uh, and there's a way out, so this is taking us to the Lost Valley. Miss camp. It is the miss camp, so we're gonna cancel because we still need to get the Lost Valley in this area. I don't think we've stumbled quite across it yet. It's a secret tower. Did you hear that? The ghosts of the Martians. They're wandering around and whispering. Hey, Drake, what are they whispering about? <laughs> no questions for Drake there, Terrence. Oh, it's you, my friend. How's everything going? Did you find the hourglass? No! Maybe someone else has already found it. Are you kidding? My luck isn't that bad. Do you want to keep this hourglass as your very own? We haven't found it. I hope you give up this idea. If not, you won't like what happens next, my friend. Oh, are we making threats now? Asking for our help, then threatening us? That's not very... That's Be not very patient, lucky of you. My clever friend. Be patient. Alright, yes, we haven't found it yet. Please stop whining about it. Alright, we're going to activate the altar just for the sake of activating it. You know what? We can rest too. We're moving forward. So any of the bosses or enemies that we haven't found yet or faced doesn't really matter. Uh, no items. And some big double doors. Open sesame, I guess. In case you missed an altar, here's another one. Uh, all right. Well, at least it's activated, and another Siffler. So let's go over to you without. Our store has been deserted for a long time. Maybe I can give you a good discount. Yeah, just like your buddy did in the village. Uh, so let's see. Oh, we have more Amundus, so that's nice. And more black water debris. But no recipes, so you know what? We're gonna be in the tower for discounts, but all my products are well worth the price. Yes, they are. 
Uh, we'll come back to him. We're going to be here for some time. Uh, and now we have... So here's where Katib really opens up. Um, first you have to get to the top of the tower, and then there's a bunch of branching paths and whatnot going back to various other locations within it. So uh, hopefully we can sort of get through some of this a little bit quick. But for now, uh, let's just see. Experiment. Is there something behind here? There is not. And we have an elevator. Does it go? It goes up. I have a feeling this is not really the way we want to go in order to reach the top. You know what? We'll take it. Nothing that way. Nope. Nothing. Alright. So. Uh, there's a door with a shortcut we can't get through quite yet. You have to open it from the other side, of course, like everything else. And we have a couple of fellows heading down the stairs here. So let's... day told you trippy flowers am I right guys trippy flowers in this whole level All right, some more doors that we can go but let's continue uh, not that way <laughs> yeah I have to watch your surroundings okay that is the way we want to go Still got to be on guard for a bunch of people. Again, can't really get through here yet. Uh, can we get through here? Yeah, I'm just waiting to see if there's... Oh, yeah, there's probably someone on the other side of this wall. Ha. Ow! potion then I don't have enough pure blood or whatever it is in order to take get the uh, what was it get the um, ooh, treasure chest and another siffler on the other side there so yeah we won't be able to get there yet uh, so up 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 we go that way. Stay there, stay there, stay there. Thank you. to do that. Alright, more black water debris. Uh, so you. These guys have torches. Oh, and I missed an execute. Oh, well. If he had an execute, then it was... He was going down anyway, so it didn't matter. All right, we're getting pretty close. I think that should be it. We should be pretty near to the top of the tower. We are. So here's here's another altar at the top. 
I'm not going to bother with resting because we don't need to. Uh, well, we have something to craft here. but we don't have the materials and I'd rather not I'd rather not change out what I have going anyway so let's grab this and here's where the level sort of opens up once you get to the top you can start unlocking your shortcuts and whoa, <laughs> carefully navigating your way sort of downwards because um, you'll be able to access other parts of the level through these branching paths. So let's go here first. And down here. This is the one that we can open. Oh no, can't. Without a key. Urgh, need a key. Need that. Uh, I don't think there's anything down that way, so let's not do that. Uh, okay, and then you have to go off the side here oh, without hopefully killing myself. You know, maybe. <laughs> I'd say maybe it's better to take Terrence because he's slower, but I don't want to make a misstep with Terrence and let my uh, sub character do all the heavy lifting. So we'll leave it for now. Okay, so there's that. Should I go down there? I have a feeling yes. Will I survive that? Possibly. What? Geronimo! <laughs> Alright, well, at the very least. Oh. Is there a ladder there the whole time? No. <laughs> That's going from somewhere else. Alright, open the chest, open the chest. Please open the chest. Three Monday. Our star has been deserted for a long time. All right. Well, yeah. You guys all say the same thing. Now he has some formulas. All right. Uh, starry honey wine uh, resets the attributes. Okay, so that's a re-roll if you want it. Mundus crystal. Uh, how many big bones do we have? Because those are going to start to become useful. Uh, I'm going to leave it for now. You know what? Nah, I'll buy it. Because uh, that will get uh, Terrence up and running a little bit faster. Uh, used to enhance trophies. Yes, we know this. Uh, elixir of stamina. Stamina regeneration. Stun crystal. Light of the Colossi, stay away, and blah, blah, blah. Cost is 100. Uh, you know what? We'll start with the Stanima Elixir. Contaminated deer blood, yay! Uh, but I already got one, and we can. That's it, that's an enemy drop. Uh, okay. Get us, Korea! I wish you success. Yes, you do. All right. So now that we've gotten these, let's climb up the ladder. Yeah, because that's this, and we dropped from, well, we didn't drop from here. Another item over there. That's not the way to go. The way to go would be this way. And... Okay, that's sort of the library area. And there's another... <laughs> like I said, there's many paths to go and I can never remember which one is the correct one. So, uh, you know what? That's gonna. We're gonna get. What do you mean no? What do you mean no? Get Terrence in there. Alright. He's, 
got our back up to us, so we're gonna, don't mind us, we're just passing through! Sort of stamina now that I got the the recipe for it. Okay, so you have this middle chamber, which I believe takes us down to the boss area, which we're not ready to go down to yet. Uh, we do have another broken page, and this side entrance here. Go all the way down and face another enemy. Missed. Starting to get easy to dispatch the uh, the lower enemies, that's for sure. Okay, so no more. Oh, there is an item there. Uh, can we get to it now? I don't think we can. You have to drop off of that little ledge in order to get the, get to it. Uh, okay, so more big bones, uh, and that's a door leading outside to the village. I Remember if that's the way we want to go. We're gonna risk it for the biscuit. Because there's no coming back once we drop down. Unless we start go all the way back up to the top and start again. Oh crap. That uh well <laughs> at least I'm here now. Uh and I forget what's here. I think there's a couple items down here that we might as well just get. You know, since we're here. couple of torch knights, torch priests. All right, well, there's that. Now the other one. of you guys. All right. Uh, health potion. Another crystal. So at the very least when we hit another altar, maybe we should do it just to start uh, getting more abilities for our two characters here. But now let's go up this ladder. Yeah, we got some, oh, we got some archers. off. There we go. And can we get up here? Nope. For some reason, it can't get up there to reach that. Oh, yes, you can. You just have to go the right way. Is this the right way? This is not the right way. Uh, all right. Well, we'll leave them alone for now because ultimately we were trying to get to here. So, ow. Open sesame! Yep, I'm abnormal. Don't care. <laughs> For now, not really suffering too much from it. This will take us back to the area of the village. Uh, but I also think that there is... Oh, where do we go from here? There is other areas that we need to travel down. And I want to make sure I get to them before we face off... Face the bosses. Uh, 
Defense or Defiance? Don't know. Okay. Uh, is this the one? Yes, this, I believe, is the one. This is the chamber that I was looking for, so... Is that a something or is that a nothing? And this will just let us fall off into the thing. Alright, I don't want to go that way quite yet. Fine. <laughs> we do not want to fall down this hole. More things and stuff and goodies. get you. Ow! Come on, come get me. Ooh! Uh, okay. You know what? It may be worth our while to sort of do a quick jellyfish jar healing here, so uh, not that. What I'm going to do, uh, we'll just take a quick sanity break and get back at it. Alright, now let's continue onwards. He's lost. Oh, he's going to see us, isn't he? We got him. <laughs> Punk. Uh, all right. More stuff for us. And continue forward. Once you hit that chest, let's just quickly dispatch these guys. I'm not gonna. Ooh, got two more. Okay, yeah. So when you reach lunatic mode, um, you'll get a shadow figure based on one of your companions coming out to fight you. So that's why you always want to make sure your sanity is within check. Oh, okay. And I think that gets us back to normal. All right, well. Interesting little aside there. Wasn't really planning on that, but I knew the flowers were there. So let's pick this up. Hey, we got ourselves a sand glass times one. I think someone may be looking for this. Uh, so yeah, we needed to find the item before squaring off against the boss. So, and I think on my other game, I failed this particular mission. So I wanted to see if I could not fail it here. We can go down here and grab this, the last letter, and we can go down. Ah, right, and then this will open up our shortcut back to the beginning of the level. And while we're here, goodbye. doing pretty well and then this will just get us back to the ladder which brought us down all the way back down here to begin with so let's see if we can return 
the hourglass to our good friend Drake before he gets, or before we get on our on his bad side. So we'll just retrace our steps all the way back to the tower. Before we go up to here, uh, let's just check over here. Yep, another shortcut. Make sure we get these dealt with. Oh, I'm not too worried about this guy. <laughs> well, used up all my throwing knives. Key to the room in Katib. All right, well, is that the key that we need in order to enter that door? If so, right, and our shortcut. Is there anything around here? There is. Always good to check around ancient silver key. So now we have two keys. And everything down that way is fine. Okay, back to the tower. Back to the Tower of Love. You dropped something. Oh, it's you, my friend. How's everything going? Did you find the hourglass? Well, I'll tell you how everything's going. I found it, but not my wife. Is this what you were talking about? Is it? Is it? Ha <laughs> ha! I knew today would be my lucky day. Here's to our new friendship. Really? Let us set off now. Everything is ready. With the help of today's good luck, we can surely find the seal of Jacob under the sacred tower. I'm sure we can. Uh, all right, well, things are actually going pretty well here, so let's go back into the tower. That's right, automatic doors of the past. Uh, all right, so I think we need to go through that middle chamber, so we'll just dodge this guy's attempts to kill us, because he can't. He can't. He's a loser. More black water debris. We are going to be leveling up all sorts of stuff. Uh, all right, let's get back up topside. There's a couple more sections that we need to unlock, but for now, I think, uh, where are we going? oh yeah, this is the, this is where I was talking about. All right, so we can pick this up. Dimming elixir times two. Such a dimming elixir. Uh, and then head on up. And it should take us back to that library section. through there. Is there... I'm going to check around. So we don't want to drop there, unfortunately. That would just be... That would be foolish. Only fools go down there. And another item. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, hi. Yeesh. Ow. Ah. Tried to stop my combo so I can execute and then couldn't even... Uh, and eventually I should start parrying his attacks. Or any enemy attacks. Ah. Alright, well... At least that finished him off. Continuing upwards. Go. All right.
Wait, we haven't even hit this section yet. So this is just like hallways leading from that uh, that altar we were at at the very top. Uh, open it. Elixirs of Recovery. So let's go down this way. This is the path we did not take. Check. Can't be opened without a key. I got two keys and I can't open it. Alright, well there's a shortcut back to... I just want to check over here. Can I... <laughs> Can't be open from this side. Oh. Alright, well here's our altar. So why don't we hit that? Uh, can... Okay, so contaminated deer blood will give us more stamina, I guess. I don't really care about it right now. Let's... Hit this. I have some crystals now. I have two crystals, in fact. Uh, reduces ch charging time. Uh, not easily interrupted during Rising Slash. I haven't... I don't think I've even started using Rising Slash. Damage by sanction pushes them to the ground. This sounds useful, as does this. So there's my two there. Uh, I think I mentioned in the last episode that, uh, yeah, Terrence, he just needs crystals and higher now. Yeah, because everything's sort of done. All right. So let's focus then on Benita. All her attacks have been taken care of. Uh, maximum sanity. Uh, normal state reduces the amount of resistance. Yep, we'll take that. Uh, consumption of elixirs increases. Sure. Sanity lost in combat may be useful, but we only have one more uh, among us, so I'm wondering if uh, chance of finding elixir formulae. Sure. Okay, and I don't. do have I think I missed that one during the last episode I was looking at my footage going hey wait I missed that so that's that ends the chipped among us for our good friend Benita okay so let's rest I know that will reset the enemies um, not really sure I know we're doing pretty well so let's see if there's something else we can do quickly before tackling on the boss. Uh, okay, so there was this staircase going up here. And again, we didn't check that. So let's do that. Uh, and then we have this sort of outside area, which should lead us to another goodie or two. I'm not going to go down, I just wanted to see... Okay, I think that gets us into somewhere that we need to unlock from the other side. Maybe. Don't really remember. Uh, but let's run around the top here. If anything, I'm wondering if we'll be finding a hedgy, well, at least an item. Uh, so pick up. And, oh. Yeah, I heard that. Ah, 
Hi there, Hedgie. Now we need to figure out what you want. You know what? Let's. Nope. Please don't go away. All right. Uh, health. Yes. Health is the thing he wants. Do your thing, Mr. Hedgie. Right. Dominator Crystal. Go down a bit, and uh, right. we're gonna go down here. And yep, there are items. There are items to be had in this room. Ow! I want to see if I can uh, parry an attack. He wasn't long for this world anyway. Alright. Uh, There's our item. Another crystal! Jeez, we just left the altar, now we're gonna have to go back! Alright, so that should hopefully open it up. And we still... Yeah, we still need a key for there, so... thought an enemy brushed by. Alright, let's do a quick altar rest. Um, uh, and we have one more crystal, so let's see what can we do. Continuous dodgings. Uh, restore to insanity. Increase by five. You know what? Let's let's make sure we can continually dodge. All right. So now we have a little bit of time left. Let's see if we can't uh, get up to the top of this tower. I think that there may be a sub encounter encounter before we hit the boss. So. Let's see if we can do that and then save the boss maybe for the next episode. Because I don't want to run these a little bit too long. Yeah, there's this big inner chamber here. And this may be where we get whatever key we need. that be? Investigate the altar. Hey Jared, how's that wound? What exactly happened to you? Get out of here, fast. This is not a place a courier should be. <laughs> I don't think any place is where a place courier should be. That's no way to respond to someone who cares. We care. Woo -woo. The altar up there seems to be connected with something under the sacred tower. It's teasing the craving of the darkness. Leave before it's too late. Uh, it's already too late. Who we can be contaminated by the central. Yeah, those darn centrals. Uh, okay, so yep, a little bit of a, a broken diary. Ah, another hedgy. So, hmm. Yes, we get it. Uh, sanity would be the easy... You know what, let's... Alright, well, sanity it is. He's going to sap us of all of it, isn't he? Oh. Three should be enough. Alright, 
Well, that's good. Uh, okay, so we need to go up one of these staircases. Oh, look, it's an altar. You seem to be worshipping something here. Let's grab this item first. Okay, and now let's trigger this. Uh, put a fragment of the sacred meteor on it. Okay. We got that from the last episode, right? Or not the last episode, the last area. Am I my wife? Oh, this is a flashback. Trippy, man. This seems to be a sign. Teresa is somehow related to the church. Look, a key appeared upon the altar. The key to the elevator. So there we go. This is what we needed to do in order to progress. All right. So, I don't want to keep these going a little bit too long, but there's still a ton of areas that we could probably explore in this area. Uh, let's see. Seems he's been contaminated by the central. Oh no, whatever shall we do? Uh, nothing, apparently. Alright. Uh, just checking around for more items, but I think we are good. Okay, so... Let's leave grab this as well for your parchment all sorts of story bits waiting waiting for us to unfold them and now that we have that key we can actually head on down Some potion. But I think we're gonna sort of let it go there. Um, we'll save the rest of Khatib. There really isn't much left. But like I said, there's a ton of hidden areas and places where you can pick up extra stuff um, all along the tower. So maybe we'll sort of go through a couple of those places and then hit the boss and in the next episode we should make it to whatever area is calling calling forth or coming up next uh, if you are enjoying this video and the pascal wager series hit that like button leave me a comment or subscribe to my channel for more mobile gaming goodness including future episodes of pascal's wager this has been shin virtual have fun, and I'll catch you in the next one. Thanks for watching.